welcome to High School's Improv! They got it, they know, they know. I went the wrong way. Today we're going to make things up for your amusement. Is there anyone here who has never seen improv before? Guys, that's what we're doing here. <coughs> Perfect! That means everyone who did not raise their hand knows what to do when I say I need you to yell out a name. George. Ted! My name. Ted! Oh, thank you! Yeah, yeah. We're gonna tell you a story about Ted in just one moment, but first, let me introduce my fools. We have you! Glutiny! Olive! Space Madness! Button! Freebies! Fromage! New shirt! And Beefcake! One and a half ankles! <laughs> <laughs> this being our first show of the day, this is our Wizards and Whimsy show. It will be slightly more magical than our other shows. <laughs> But I have promised you a story about Ted. And for that, I need Button, Fromage, and Q. They're going to tell you a story about Ted one word at a time. Now, Ted was searching for something magical, something you could eat. What was that item? Unicorn. <laughs> Unicorn, you monster. <laughs> Fine, this is the story of Ted and the unicorn, one word at a time. Ted was ravenous for meat. Unicorn. Ted loved to eat many, many unicorns. <laughs> However, he was finding that it wasn't very appropriate for him to eat other unicorns because that is oh cannibalism <laughs> so he ventured forth in two woods and the fields of magic to seek the newest foods and Find a council who would enlighten his dietary palate <laughs> inside of a house. He dialogued <laughs> with a red dwarf. This red <laughs> dwarf told him many things, especially not to eat unicorns. But Ted didn't listen very <laughs> well.